What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like and subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon. We're posting four videos every day, so make sure to check back every single day. We've just hit 20k subscribers, so thank you all so, so much. Let's get to 30k and get a deal in the description if you haven't already. Plenty of free crypto and goodies down there. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe and the bell icon. People aren't seeing our content and this is probably because you haven't hit the bell icon. Thank you again for all your support. The algorithm is slamming a lot of content creators right now, so we really appreciate all your support. And we're so proud of the amazing community that we've built. So make sure to jump into the Telegram and the free Discord. So just taking a look at Strong here, and as we can see, it's looking as though, you know, we're still heading up in this big channel that we have formed. As we said previously, we actually had this resistance line drawn in for a while once we had this level here and this level here. And then we came up and we found this level here and we drew in this. Let me just make sure this is in the right place, actually. It's just a bit ski whiff. You can see we've got that resistance stuck in something like that. And it basically we came up and we made that next all time, that next all time high, didn't we? Where it's, it kind of, you know, it, may, it makes a fairly confluent resistance, doesn't it? Looking something like this across all these lines and make sure that's in the right place. And you can see here, you know, after this happened, we said, OK, we'll make, you know, a parallel, a parallel ish support line to, to kind of, you know, go with this channel and make this like kind of a parallel channel. And you can see here, we obviously had this touch line here and then this area here where we have come down towards the bottom of the channel again, looking like we might be, you know, coming up in, in some kind of motion like this. Or, you know, you could you could obviously say potentially we are looking something like this as well, which would be totally fine, in my opinion. This is still, you know, very bullish market structure. I might save this in actually because it's probably more has more confluence than you would say the the potential parallel channel that we're seeing. But you can see, you know, heading up, heading to the upside here, we're holding the support really nice, aren't we? We've got the one touch, two touch here. This is where you formed your trend line. We have the massive run up, don't we? From wherever this was, ninety three dollars to one thousand two hundred dollars. A crazy, crazy price for strong. We get that huge rollover, don't we? When we're going downwards in that channel for a good while. You can see here we actually drew this channel in pretty much perfectly. Resistance support, resistance support, resistance support coming down. And then once we got the breakout, we come down, we back test this area really bullish, back testing, you know, the bottom and the top of the uh, of that channel there. But we get the breakout and the back test is support super bullish. We come down, we get the retests of our macro trend line at the bottom here. You can see the bullish divergence is happening. Massive bullish divergence here on the RSI. We start to get that scooped cup bottom, you know, rounding off at the bottom formation. And now looking like, you know, we're just heading back up through some levels for strong here. Back to the upside towards the middle of the channel, which would be up at around the thousand dollars now. So if we throw our Fibonacci levels on here from that swing high to this swing low, assuming that this is the bottom now, you can see here just how much confidence that these levels actually do have. It's really quite amazing. I always look at the fibs and think, wow, these are actually just unbelievable levels that you could potentially trade. You can see here, we get that curved bottom here. We come up, resistance at the, uh, zero, the 038 there, support of the 023. Resistance is the 050, support of the 023. We come up, we front run the 618 here, and we're rolling back down now to retest our EMAs by the looks of it. But the EMA is flipping bullish again, so things looking pretty good for strong in our opinion. And from what we can tell, you know, Strong's just on a journey right now, isn't it? And until we see this, you know, trend line here being lost, which would currently come in at around 530 ish dollars. If we really lose this trend line here and start to roll down back down towards this level here, we could be looking at Strong rolling over to back down to some of these lower prices, maybe down to 200, 300, 400 dollars. And obviously it remains to be seen how we will perform because of the, you know, the sell pressure that increases all the time with people essentially, you know, hodling a lot of nodes and then just selling their awards and not holding on to them. It generates a lot of sell pressure for strong and um you know obviously with the decay models coming out soon for strong which will potentially you know lower the sell pressure somewhat and with all the bullish news that we're seeing we could be looking at strong having a recovery you know over the over 2022 and we'll have to see you know where it starts to sit once everything settles down but overall we are bullish on strong we do think the company is obviously really good the the concept is really good and a lot of people have been benefiting heavily from strong Obviously, having a really, really nice amount of um, a really, really nice amount of good price action 
throughout 2021. Obviously, loads of community members doing really well, retiring themselves, etc., etc. We'd always recommend taking profits. Obviously, it's not financial advice, but don't uh, put all your eggs in one basket and do remember that your strong nodes, they don't, they're not actually worth anything intrinsically. You can't sell them once you actually make a new node. So consider taking some profits sometimes so that you don't expose yourself to, you know, having loads of nodes, but obviously never taking any profits is not a good idea, basically. So not financial advice, but just something to consider. Make sure that you don't put all your eggs in one basket, take some profits, put them in something else, generate yourself a yield in another place, or at least keep some of the money to the side in case anything anything does happen to strong that we can't anticipate. But overall, looking like we're doing pretty well. Short term price predictions, we'd say, you know, we, if we come back down to that 038, we'll probably get a bounce just under that $600 level. Obviously, that's a big psychological support as well. Heading to the upside, we want to break that 618, $750, heading up to back towards the middle of the channel at around $1,000. And then, you know, it's hard to decide, you know, long term price predictions for strong because it doesn't really operate, as we said, like a conventional cryptocurrency because there is a, you know, a kind of yield mechanic with it, the, the constant sell pressure that you don't necessarily see for other cryptos. So we'll have to, we don't think it's probably just going to continue pumping forever, but we might see a halving of rewards, which would obviously be bullish for the price. And not to mention, if we do see ourselves having fractionalized nodes, etc., we could see a massive spike in demand because of that. So I'd like to thank everyone so much for their support. If you've got any questions or suggestions, please leave them down below and don't forget to subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon to stay up to date with four videos we post every single day. Remember, if you want to support the channel more directly and get a ton of benefits and insight, as well as joining our growing community, consider the Patreon or YouTube membership down below. There are three tiers giving you access to our private Discord. Crypto support is available if you just want to help us out a small amount. Crypto Maximalist is our main tier, which gives you access to detailed daily technical analysis and signals, weekly and monthly coin calls, and insights into our personal moves, while Maximalist Gold takes it a step further giving you an insight into our personal portfolio tracker, super low cap gem research, and a 100x portfolio we're constructing and updating, and access to us personally as a resource to discuss your portfolio via Messenger. Make sure to check it out. You can also sign up to our free Telegram and public Discord via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto, so go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are... Crypto Maximus.